Have you ever experienced those nights when no matter how much you try, you just can't sleep because you're anxious and excited about something that's gonna happen the next day? Well, this was one of those nights and after a long, long struggle, I'm finally graduating and to me, this graduation is a miracle. I could hardly sip my coffee that morning, I just kept fidgeting. I started by getting out of the house and going to school to get my gown. My university is called JPAT by the way and this is how beautiful it is but it's public. It's a public university and if you're in Kenya you know public just means struggle so we had to wait for quite a while before getting our gowns but eventually we got them and we fitted them and we were just chatting and allowing the time to pass by but after that we decided to take um, a group photo shoot with my friends because after that we didn't know when we will meet each other again so yeah yeah this is the gown I got I'm usually this type, I'm a bit choosy, but funny enough, this time around, I did not go around choosing gowns. I don't want this one, I want that one. I just picked the one I was given. They were like taken, I just took it because, yeah, I was so happy. I like how it looks. Yeah, I'm good with it. It's uh, long enough. Nobody wants a short gown, I know I'm tall, but yeah, it's beautiful the way it is. I loved the blue on the cap. It's royal blue. Royal blue is my favorite color and I was just happy. I was so, so excited. Time for a snack break. Um, I can never refuse a chocolate. We were all happy and um, I really liked how the school was so neat. They had really cleaned it and um, prepared it for our graduation. That was really nice of them. Uh, flags are all around. I don't know why, but they look nice and that's all that matters. Yeah, so eventually we had to go back home uh, and prepare for other things. And that was that. So I got my gown today. Early the next morning, I had to wake up and go to town to run some errands, my errands, my graduation errands. So I first stopped at the salon because I wanted to get my nails done. And this is what I got. Yeah, you all know I'll choose blue. There's no other color that I can choose. I, I really loved it. And believe it or not, these are my nails. I haven't put any stick-ons or anything. I just shaped them myself before going to the salon. And I love what they did. Um, I bought some earrings too. This is what I'm going to wear on that day uh, I really like how they're unique I've actually never seen such before then I got some shoes too they are silver matching with the earrings and it's just so amazing I'm not the high heel type but uh, this is my graduation so yeah after all that we took a small break with my sister we just stopped by to take some food and it was so amazing chips masala and samosa that's usually my go-to anytime i'm outside because this is not something i can cook for myself in the house so yeah <laughs> The next day I had to start by doing my makeup. I am a stylist, I am a beautician, so I wasn't going to go to anybody to do my makeup for me because I can do it by myself. So I was just kind of like rinsing my face to clean it so that it may be easy to work with. So I was using this uh, aloe vera and tea tree oil face wash that really works so well for me and it smells so nice. Then after that I will start to put on my makeup.
It really feels so, so nice to put on this gown. It's so amazing. I mean, for four years, I think it's five because of Corona, we have just been str struggling. Can I say struggling? We have <laughs> been amidst all the distractions that are in campus. I have graduated. It has really taken the hand of God and I'm very, very grateful. I cannot even explain how happy I am. I decided to wait for the photographer who was fixing something in his camera and as I was waiting I was just checking myself out making sure that everything is perfect perfecto and when the west is red with the sun Now I just had to select the photos that I wanted. Uh, the cherry on top is usually a graduation party but mine is a little bit private so I'm not gonna show it because not all my family and friends like um, publicity and cameras so I'll stop right here. But I only have one question, after graduation what next?